Let's take a look at the Cubase channel comparison feature, which allows us to quickly go back and forth between two channels in your project, often used to resolve frequency clashes. So let's say if I wanted to work in a typical scenario where maybe we have piano and guitar and they're occupying the same frequency range and we wanted to tweak those to sit better in a mix. Let's take a quick listen. So to compare these two channels, what I'm gonna do is select the guitar channel. We'll open up its channel settings. In the EQ window in the upper left hand corner, we're going to activate the channel comparison. So now I'm going to, in the orange box, select the channel I want to compare the guitar track to. So we'll come over and select our piano. And now as we play, even when we look at the EQ, we can see the two channels superimposed on each other. If I wanted to make that more apparent visually, we could go to the settings and I'll just switch the transparency settings to 100 for demonstration purposes. And now as we play, so if I select the piano, you see the piano frequencies see the guitar frequencies. So now I can EQ. The guitar. And if I wanted to enable the listen mode. go to our piano track. Let's add a little reverb to our piano. Bring the reverb back. Just a reverb in a guitar. Now, if I wanted to select a different track for comparison, let's say our bass, I could again just go to my orange box, select the bass, and So you can see that you can quickly navigate between two channels to resolve different clashes that may be occurring, whether it's different effects or EQ frequencies. If you found this video helpful, please feel free to like the video and to subscribe to the channel.